What's going on, everybody? This is Adam Sobor Song. You're my friend Muhammad, the Jin Abdel Razak, local legend. This guy got double gold at the last grappling tournament he went to. We're looking for double gold next time as well. Anyway, we're just playing around with some no-gi BJJ stuff tonight. We're going to hold off on the judo and the gi Brazilian jiu-jitsu for tomorrow, on Friday. We're just going to be a lot colder. Okay? So I just wanted to share with you guys a way you can pass the butterfly guard and the sit-up guard if your opponent gives you some real problems. Uh, once you pass this, once you pass the guard, then you are in a really good position to where you can get a uh, better position from there and then maybe a quick tap. Okay. So, right here, in Muhammad's butterfly guard. Now, obviously, what do we want to do? We want to get that flat because he's strong. If he's here, if he's here, he's going to sweep me and do whatever. So, I want to drive him down. Okay? Now, I know lots of different ways to pass him here. I take my leg up. Trap here, come to side control. I come here, boom, put my head here. Head stand pass, and come to here. One of these really, really flexible, and he's following me. Boom, I come here, check all those legs. Come over here, and pass, all right? So, all those are great. If he's not fighting. The problem is, if he's comfortable using butterfly guard and fighting, then he's not gonna let me drive him to the mat so easy. He's gonna be here, he's gonna be moving inside, trying to get bury his head. Problem, right? He's strong. Okay, so what am I gonna do from here? I'm gonna back up a bit, come to combat base, and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my hands, the web of my thumb here, hook underneath his ankles, and roll him back this way. Okay? Now, I need to make sure when I do that, I'm here, I'm going to combat this, I come up, that I don't just sit here and roll him over and look at him because he's going to double leg me from here. Right? So I always need to be thinking preemptively. So I'm here, boom, boom, I come here, I'm thinking, go to his back, go to his back, and I'm here. Okay? Now, I don't want to seat belt right away because I'm going to get swept. And here, just kind of like keeping my weight on, keeping this leg way out so it doesn't grab it, and keeping all my pressure down so it can't sit out of a color guard. Okay, from here, I'm going to take my far side leg with my hook hand. Okay, so I have my right hook hand. From here, then I seat belt control. Okay, now it doesn't matter if he goes left or right where I still got him. I'm going to pull him into me, boom, put the other hook in, come here for a short show, finish. Okay, one more time a little bit faster. So, try the walk over pass here during the day, to the back taking choke, and go review. 